Never a dull moment round here, people. Anyway, watch ya. Just setting the alarm, going out. Just another day in the life of us on tour, mooching around, seeing what the world's got to offer us. This is a video within a video. So every now and then, I say every now and then, I'd say probably once or twice a week we get emails from people asking us to help promote a product, a service, software or anything else. Um, see on this, but it's like a connected parallel. So they have a bit of rope connecting them together and they've got to get round the course. Oh, I mean, they've done well. Yeah, well done. Oh, it just come undone as I went across the finish line. But that is tricky. Yeah, he did it, he's got his thumbs up. Yeah. So that takes a lot of skill. This one over here is the slowest race ever. So they've got to come down round and back up as slow as they can possibly go and then over here we'll go and sit in the grandstand in a minute and then we'll see some of the guys doing their i'm guessing this bit over here is for practicing before they go into the main arena which is over there Cone over. So I think this is police forces from all over the country, right? It's not just Las Vegas. I've seen Las Vegas and Utah. Right, I might, might be local then. Because this seems a lot of police bikes for just Vegas, doesn't it? Yeah, I don't think it's just Vegas, but there's some trucks down there with the names of them on there. All right, we're at a 1.3 out on the corner. Jerry to San Diego, two meaty again. San Diego, he's second name. Married for 30 years, with two kids. One daughter-in-law, one grandchild. 25 years on the department, 15 as a motorized so that's him going sure next, San Diego 1. 5, 1. 127, 129, all that. Well, maybe that's him, I don't know. Well, that was an impromptu stop. We were driving past, we saw a load of trailers and a load of motorcycles. And then uh, we thought, well, let's go and have a look at what's going on over here. And um, yeah, as you see, it's uh, quite an interesting thing, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, our ambulance is coming. It's good fun. And Joanna, that was on our um, World West tour, she was a um, LAPD. Was in Los Angeles. 
she was Vegas, in, wasn't she? I thought it was LA. Oh, I don't know. I have to check. Anyway, she was a motorcycle rider for the police department and she actually won the slow riding competition that she was. Was it the slow riding she'd done? No, I thought she'd done the whole slalom. Oh, did she? Yeah. I don't know. We'll have to ask. Now we've watched it and understand what the different things are. I think she competed against 168 other guys um, and she won Ooh. amongst them all. But we'd need to check that. But we'll put that on here. Um, anyway, we're going to go and grab a bite to eat and we're having a round of golf this afternoon. Looking should, forward to it. It should be good. Should be a laugh, shouldn't it? Yeah, anyway. Try not to kill anybody. <laughs> try not to kill anyone. This is a video within a video. So every now and then, I say every now and then, I'd say probably once or twice a week we get emails from people asking us to help promote a product, a service, software or anything else. Um, and every now and then, I think this is probably our second actually, um, we've done the Ridge Wallops about a year or so ago. But anyway, we got approached by a company called Hover, Hover Air. So they sent us one. So we're out today, giving it a bit of a test. Can't believe the size of it. I mean, look, it's it, it's absolutely tiny. Hold that camera a second, please, my love. But look, you just open it like that. And that is it. That is. And it connects to your phone as well. It connects to your phone. Else. It's all these different settings on the top, which we'll go through. <laughs> but um, other than that, it's lightweight, it's compact, it came with two batteries, and we thought, yeah, you know what? We'll give that a go. There we go. There's the difference between an iPhone 15 Pro Max and the Hover Air. Super tiny, huh? So that's five feet from the ground. Oh, five feet off the ground. Yeah. And that will just stay there, will it? Dolly track, so it should go in front of us, and as we walk forward, <laughs> and that's how you take off and land. Pretty cool, huh? Follow us. Oh, that was fun. We've chucked it up, we've done a couple of bits. We climbed up that. It was a bit steep. I nearly fell over. Uh, but other than that, for the price of these things, I've got to say, I'm really impressed. If you're into adventure or a bit of tracking or a bit of running or even cycling, I think it'd be absolutely fine for a bit of mountain biking. Um, its tracking abilities is pretty special. Um, and its price point is very good. So um, if you're in the market for a very small, compact, um, long lasting battery, I mean, we've just done about five or six different separate flights. It's probably been up in the air for, I would guess, 
20 minutes? Yeah, maybe 20 minutes. It's still got just under 50% battery, so, and it comes with two batteries, so you've got best part of an hour's worth of flying there. Um, maybe longer. I mean, weather conditions here is pretty perfect. There's a little breeze. There's nothing more than a, just, just a very slight breeze. I mean, nothing's really moving, as you can see by these. It's not windy at all, really. So yeah, performed very well. So anyway, like I say, if you're in the market for one, I'll put a link on the screen or in the comments below or both. So anyway, we're back at our, our home-ish space now. So we'll uh, go back in, get some water. And um, if you're interested in sending us an email about a product that you'd like us to review or put in one of our videos, and you think that it is actually relevant to what we do, by all means, ping us an email. See ya. Never a dull moment round here, people. Anyway, watch ya. Just setting the alarm, going out. New car. Oh, new car day today. We're off. We're. Uh, oh. Oh, can you drive? Right, this one is going in for some work. So we're picking up a loaner today, but we've got to fly to the bank, pick up a cashier's check, and then go to Audi, drop the beast off, and then no more and then. And then we're off to pick up the new car. Anyway, we'll see you on the road. Bank, done. Audi, next. Peace. Drop the Q7 in. That's done. Didn't tell you how to do that. Or did I? Can't remember. Anyway, that's dropped off. We're in a loner with nice brown seats. Mmm, tasty. And just grabbing ourselves a nice Starbucks. Much needed Starbucks on our magical mystery tour today. Mm. Anything you'd like to add to the video, my sharps? Other than your nice new hat? Cheers. Cheers everybody. Cheers everybody. Peace out. So, we're here. You never guess where. Gelding Porsche. Las Vegas, baby. So, as you can see, they've got quite a selection of toys. Plenty of stock. And we're here today, picking up. Have a guess, have a guess. That could be it. That could be it. Oh, let's have a look. Da, da, da. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. We appreciate it. Have some tints. Hey, there, man. Andrew. Sorry, just filming for our YouTube channel. Of course. Got it. I've just missed out on that GT3. I know. These these cars are pre-sold before they even come in. Jason messaged me literally as we were pulling in. He said, "Quick, get down there. They've got a GT3." <laughs> Two it's really bad light. Well, we have to activate a few things on the vehicle. Did you get an email from Porsche? I have, yeah, I've done my bit. Okay. So I just need to log in with yeah, the. Tent's nice though. Yeah, it is nice. Yeah, it's sweet. Yeah, nice. I'll be right back. I'm going to inform Matthew and get the Porsche for a Thanks. Where are we going? 
we're off to uh, it's Blue Diamond and red it's rock. called uh, something it's Loop. It's Red Rock Scenic Loop. Oh, Scenic We've wanted loop. to do it for a while. We wanted to do it on the bikes when we had the higher bikes and we didn't get around to doing it. Um, and then we wanted to do it on our bikes when we got them, but obviously the problems with uh, CBO, we don't have it back yet. Uh, so yeah, we're going to go and show you a little bit of the, the scenic area around Red Rock. Hopefully go for a little stroll. So, where are you going? Where? Well, how do you know which way it is? I've got no idea. Is it up past the valley? Oh, this looks. What are you on about? It's a bit of point there. I'm pointing at the tr the path. Oh. Ah, it's 1.5 miles long. Oh. Well, we have to phone for a rescue because we get lost in in the wilderness. I've lost him already. But there he is. So red rock is this limestone, but we've not actually touched the red rock, have we? Oh my god, it's really cool there. I know it's in the shade though. Should go and hug a tree. Do you want to have a go? Do you want to hug a tree? Hug a twig. Hug a twig. Shiny bits. Climb that. Climb it. Colin could. I don't think I could. Stunning, right? That is a constant thing that pisses me off. People make a point of getting poo bags, put their dog poo in a bag, tie it up, stick it on the floor. The poo's more degradable than the freaking bag. Idiots. That's that's literally just gone right in. Oh my god. Oh. That just. They're not poisonous, are they? Well, because that's just gone straight in my toe. Whose idea was this? They are sharp. Oh my god, what are you doing to me? Oh, that's a cute one. <laughs> Great walk that, all I seem to have done is looked at my feet. Anyway, we're not at that car park, we're at the one that's right up here. We started here, we've just done this. Now we're here, and now we're gonna go and do this bit. So we've got 1.1 miles left. Well they rose, time for a feasting and ceremony. Oh they're eating 
tortoise. Hmm? They ate tortoise. Who do? The native people. Oh, that's not very nice. I don't know if you can see it, but just on this rock here, it's a climber. We've just met three, three or four people going the other way with big backpacks and they've said that they've been climbing. But that is a sheer face there. And there's been somebody singing opera or something down the bottom as well, so it must be quite acoustic. He's out of brainwave. We are gonna go and sit up in there. Should be interesting. I suggest she go first, I'll follow. I think it'd be easy getting up. I, I think we'll fall out of it coming down. But let's give it a go. It's like a big clamshell. Has it got any ice cream in it? Get your hand trapped. Just another day in the life of us on tour, mooching around, seeing what the world's got to offer us. And I'll tell you what, that was quite steep coming back up there. How's that for you coming up there? Oh, she was moaning 30 minutes ago. Ah, she wasn't really. Anyway, we're back up. Morning all. Right, so the Moto Studio is here today to uh, detail and ceramic coat. This is Andy. Andy, morning. say morning. <laughs> it is. Well, that was it. He was here at eight o'clock this morning. It's now 20 past six. He's off. What a day. 